know, because when you get to the Jubilee, that is a time you feel, I have achieved. There are so many people who would have wanted to be where you are, and they have not reached. So it's God's work that you're here. And number two, I always say, show me your friends, and I'll know about you. And today you have shown me your friend, Susan. I have seen them today, and I know what kind of person you are. A blessed woman of God. My name is Janet Wainaina Mwangi. That is Mwangi, my better half, or my better fool. And, <laughs> and uh, you know, I'm a blessed woman. I'm a teacher. I teach chemistry, physics, and uh, biology. Wow. So anybody who's struggling, I am that teacher who will teach any child. Eh? <laughs> physics, yeah, physics, yeah. Nikuliza swali sai. I'll ask, I'll, ask you, I'll ask you a simple one. Name for me five renewable type of energy. <laughs> oh, we thank God, we thank God. Pastor <laughs> Torode. Please, me ask, ask me anything. Ask, ask me this <laughs> Okay, 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 okay. Okay. Right, what? Okay, what is the difference between <laughs> what is the difference between beta, gamma waves? Talk to me. Beta and gamma. It's their their, their wavelength. One has a shorter wavelength and the other one has a greater wavelength. <laughs> right. <laughs> <laughs> right. <laughs> now, can I say something very quickly? This, <laughs> that table has won. This table has lost. I do, tu I do tuition, by the way. <laughs> I do tuition, yeah? I do tuition on, in Slough. No, no, not for the children. I might have to do tuition for the adults so they can help the children. Gumbaro. Right. I'll talk very quickly, but I also wanted to make sure that we are having a good time. Are we having a good time? We are celebrating Sister Susan, and it's important for us to be happy when she's here, because you know what? It's not every day we have a celebration. We've come from a COVID season. We have not been able to see each other. Now we see each other. So that's enough for us to thank God. Now, for me, before I get started with telling you who Nala is. As Africans, we're often underestimated pushed aside, told to wait for others to solve our problems. It's time to change the narrative around our future. That's what Nala represents. <laughs>